So in today's video guys, I'll be showing you a brand new base drop script working in Lumber Tycoon 2. So yeah, let me show you guys how to get the script and how to use it in today's video. So what you want to do is come over to the link in the description of this video where it says script, press on the link and it will take you to this website, getexploits.com or just search it. And to get the script, what you want to do is go to the script section by pressing this. And then you should see Lumberware Lumber Tycoon 2 GUI. So you, there is multiple GUIs that can base drop in Lumber Tycoon 2. But one I'll be using in today's video is Lumberware. So what you want to do is press on the script. And once you press the script, it will take you to the script page. And from here, you get to see a picture of it and the feature list but if anything like this pops up just close it off and then resume on the website and you might even get a pop-up added like this close it off and then resume on the website and as you can see this is the script the picture the feature list this is the get script button you just press this and you will get the script and i suggest joining their discord server as well if you want to support on anything at all and this is the credits for today's video so shout out to this person right here and yeah all you guys need to do is press get script, copy the script, paste it into whatever execute you use and attach and execute into a Roblox game. And I'm currently using a Microsoft version of Roblox to execute my scripts. And uh, yeah, and I have an executor that allows me to execute into the Microsoft version of Roblox. And that is how I'm able to still use scripts. So here we go, guys. I have just joined into a game. What I'm going to do right now is execute the script. And yeah, there we go. This is what we're going to do. Executed. And the game will freeze a little bit. But don't worry, it will come back into the game. There we go. So yeah, here is, here is the script right here. Lua version 4.1. And... Uh, the only thing I don't like about GUIs these days is these open and close buttons right here. I think they should get rid of this. Luckily, you can actually scroll this down um, for some reason. This is the exact same thing I said about uh, Dark X as well. I don't. I just don't like these like on-game UI um, stuff on the screen. But the GUI is very very nice. I like the rainbow gradient around the GUI looks very very nice but in today's video like I said we are going to be checking out checking out the base drop so what I'm going to do right now is loading my base let me check if they have the fast load they do have a fast load so I'm just going to put it to one uh, I want to load in my slot one let's put fast load on and uh, let's just press load base and hopefully that should load in my slot one really really quickly so let's see if that works and there we go it has worked very very nice so after this uh, these are things you don't have to do i'm just doing it just so it's easier for me um in this game and also uh, another thing i want to do is put always day because i just prefer it day uh, rather than night and i still need to review this gui fully so i will do a full review on lower very very soon but you guys should have seen a script review on this gui but by another youtuber maybe not then uh, just wait around and i will get around to it guys and i'm just going to put the brightness up a little bit as well the brighter it is the better well obviously not but the right amount of um brightness but anyway enough of that let's get into the base dropping so what you want to do is scroll down on the features tab and you should be able to see base drop press on it and as you guys can see there's item teleportation and wood teleportation and even a friend base drop and a friend base drop i believe is basically where you can base drop from another person's base. I'm not 100% sure about this. You guys should try it out if you have friends to do this with. Try it out. Uh, I've currently got no one to try this with currently. Um, I'm trying to get this video out for you guys very, very soon um, because I'm recording at midnight right now and I need to get this video up. So I can't get anyone on to try this feature out but if you guys can want to try out if you're du duping or base dropping with friends then uh, try it with this but other than that yeah i'm pretty sure you just need to toggle in this button right here which is the group selection toggle it on and then go to the person's base and you can just select a item just by pressing on it 
and you it will get highlighted and you can base drop it i don't know if there's multi multi selections in this script or i mean gui um but i'm pretty sure there is we can well we'll find out later on once we try out this base drop so in today's video actually i'm gonna gift a few many axes why not in this server someone was as actually asking for some but anyway enough of the waffle let me show you guys so i'm just going to be doing items i'll do wood later on as well so for items what you want to do is there's also there's two options a single selection let me turn that on and show you guys single selection is where where you can just press a single item and just select one item but that seems to be not working on this gui which is very very annoying um okay it is working it just just doesn't work for axis for some reason they need to implement it for the axis but yeah it works on other stuff uh, let me see wood okay this is the item so obviously it's not going to work but um but yeah they should probably implement it for the axis as well but for items it actually works see it is i'm individually clicking it um actually these are not um selecting for some reason so yeah they need to make this a little bit more stable i guess uh, or more effective but yeah this one did select but for some reason the others aren't so i would suggest just using the group selection for now um so if you press on any okay let me deselect first if you press on anything um okay for some reason it's not selecting what's going on okay the axes are working so the scoop heads was working before i did this video but for some reason it's not working right now um, but yeah, so as you guys can see, the axis is selected for this one, but not for the single uh, selection. So yeah, it's quite odd, um, but obviously try out, see what works for you guys. And I will upload more base drop videos in the future anyway. So if this, regard, if this one doesn't work the best for you guys, there will be more coming soon. But yeah, guys, let me actually show you guys how to do this. So once you selected your item that you want, I'm just going to go and give some access to people. Let me put some walk speed on. And once I'm here, go back into the base drop. And all I'm going to do is press teleport selected items. And it will individually teleport all of the selected items one by one, as you guys can see. So it's not an instant method anymore. That has been completely patched in Lumber Tycoon 2 so yeah this is the current version that we are available to use so yeah very very nice and if you want to stop it all you need to do is press deselect de items and as you can see we have stopped the base drop and as you can see if i come over here there is the axis once again very very nice and if i want to whitelist my friend or whatever and give the items to the person you guys can do so but yeah that's pretty much it for the items let's try it out for the wood so yeah they might need to make it a little bit more stable because it, the scoop just didn't work for some reason but yeah let me try the wood now so i'm just going to put the wood selection let's put it to blue wood and as you guys can see it is working and it, this is a singular selection for some reason they should probably add the group selection as well for this so as you guys can see i'm just singularly se selecting them and um yeah there we go um i'm just gonna try and base uh, base drop these one two three four five blue wood trees well planks so i'm just gonna press teleport selected wood and let's see the magic happen so as you guys can see it's doing it for me it is teleporting the wood one by one to the base now let's go over there as you guys can see it has teleported here and it's facing it up as well so that's really really cool but yeah that's pretty much it that's all i wanted to check out in today's video obviously there's another part of it which is the friend base drop try out guys but that's pretty much it from me in today's video guys sorry if i waffled a bit in today's video it has been a long day for me that's why i'm also recording very very late so but i'm obviously on my grind right now so i just want to get a video for you guys anyway so i don't miss a day for you guys the grind is back on this channel guys but yeah try this out let me know how what you think of it in the comments down below and yeah i'll see you in the next one guys thank you so much for watching i'll see you in the next one like subscribe and peace